Welcome into another video. Becky and I got back to antiquing. This time we went to Huntsville, Texas. Of course, we hope we find some gold and we both love copper. So we're always hunting that down as well. She's looking for rotary phones and roosters. And of course, we both have jewelry on the brain. Join us. Let me give you a ring because <laughs> I've been scrambling and we're told you that. saying that. Oh, it is beautiful. Is it gorgeous? Uh, yeah. We didn't ship it. I knew you. Good How are you this morning? Uh, you make it down here okay? Yeah. Y'all you know, been in the shop before, right? I've uh, been here before, yeah. We found out it used to be a JC Kenny. So pretty in well, here. Anything? This was such a wonderful little shop. There were several shops in the area, but this one was especially nice. They had incredible artwork, very eclectic. There was jewelry in every single corner. Just fabulous. necklace to the uh -huh. dress that I'm wearing, this Trafari. Oh, okay. I'm having a hard time finding the matching That's kind of pretty there. It kind of looks like it. I don't know if that's a full set or I what. I know, but I'm having the hardest time finding. Trafari? Yeah. It's mm -hmm. so smooth. It the, feels like butter. Yeah. These yeah, are good prices on some of these brooches, too. Yeah. Oh, is that another shoe? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Remember that shoe I got last time? Oh, yes. I haven't given it to her. I'm going to give it to her for Christmas. I gave her the yeah. other copper. She loved it. Oh. The stained glass is gorgeous. More than the other one that I saw. The pig. Oh, it's a Melissa and Doug. Oh, yeah. They have beautiful uh -huh. things. Heirloom. They're oh, so yeah. cute. It's cute. It looks like a beehive. More jewelry. <laughs> things. These are pretty. They have it kind of spewing. As you go, you'll see all kinds of cabinets with jewelry. Malachite looking cross. It's Ava. Uh, oh, that one's Ava? That's gorgeous. I know, I'm Circle. thinking, what would Thelma think? <laughs> <laughs> what would she say if she saw this? Beautiful things. Yeah, I'm telling you, the antique store that's down the road by the chicken in a basket, just like this. Right. And came across a little baggie and had three sterling silver things in there. It had a 20 French necklace and then two ID bracelets. They were mm -hmm. black as could be. Sterling silver Italy. Exactly. Shana, oh my, and, they, and I had to just, I was just rummaging. And they're just through. there, people don't. Uh -huh. It look. was underneath a whole bunch of stuff in a bowl, just like that, just hidden. Last things are hidden. It's like, wow, that's a bingo. <laughs> a definite bingo, <laughs> Becky. Like, wow. Becky got a bingo. Yeah, I know. <laughs> she's got to find another bingo another jar of bingo when when you found those jars miss becky did you find them in the same booth i don't no, know no that is so strange <laughs> and they were both pretty good i mean the first one was phenomenal but they were two different but the booths were only that is so crazy <laughs> i'm wearing the jade oh yeah i recognize it yeah they had so many $5 grab bags, but it seemed like most of them were broken jewelry, broken pieces. I still kind of kicked myself for not buying one, but we were quite engaged and loved the brooches as well. There were some very different ones. Each booth, of course, has their own way of pricing things. So there were anywhere from $8 to $35. Most of them were tagged with their brand names in the front. So it was really, um, really quite nice. Very nice to be able to see whether it was a Sarah Coventry or Monet or whatever. And um, didn't buy everything I wanted to buy, that's for sure. See, and those got real stones. You know those are real stones for $5. Mm -hmm. They are, and it's probably mm -hmm. gold filled too. Mm -hmm. This is darling, I love that. Mm -hmm. That is gorgeous. Okay, if that's amber, I need it. Look at that. Like the real deal. I think it is. It like the real deal. I need to get somebody's attention like right now. It does. It's like the real deal. I'm going to go see. It, I, if I was betting money, I bet Yeah, it that is. <laughs> and it looks. him to have him in the Yes, room. and I can get that little tiger oh, too. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That's really nice. I, and it's the okay. set. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's amber. Mm -hmm. It looks really like bracelet. it is because you can, mm -hmm. you can tell. I take this. It's Texas pin right next to the flower. 
I've had this cat in silver. Which one? This huge oh. cat. I've had him in silver. Oh, I've how had that. How cute is that? And I think I still have that in black I with have a matching who has earrings. earrings. She's got the earrings. Yeah. Red. I've had it in black. I had the whole set there. Beautiful brooch too. Oh no, but cool cat. It's humongous. Are not bad. Mm -mm. This is, we're taking our time. <laughs> oh, this is pretty too. This one's glass, amber yeah. glass. Ooh, that's nice. It I'm looks so like short. oh, it's gorgeous here. You can see it right here, Becky. Oh, it oh. looks like tiger eye. It even looks like oh, you know what it looks like that it's blue. Beautiful. Kainite, kainite. It sure does. I gotta see that necklace. That's stacked. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Vincent's filigree. And I used to love to collect. In fact, I still have a lot. Postcards with real pictures or pictures of people. Just kidding. Right? Another sterling pin up here. Look at that little log cabin. Yeah, they have so much. Oh my gosh, that lion is darling. See, I saw this cat's last time. Oh, that's and cute. And I thought that was cute for $6. I don't know if it's an apple. Yeah, that's an apple. Is it? Hey, look, there's a bee for Becky. <laughs> <laughs> Did I see that last time? I don't even remember if I saw that last This. This cameo is pretty. Oh, I'm, I'm sort of kind of getting into cameo, back into cameos. My mom has a few. Look at these cats. <laughs> and the poodle. I love the poodles too. <laughs> Two five for twelve dollars. Look at the clover. I know. I was oh, just looking eyeballing it. Oh, that is cute. so it's many pictures. Get Mickey it's all blinged it. out. That's a Napier brooch. That, I've seen about three of these already, and I've had. Uh -huh. I actually had him. Uh -huh. This is a bunch of different. Oh, it's a nice patriotic Christmas one. It's nice when they clump it together. These are cufflinks if I ever saw them. Look at those flashy cufflinks. To me, like they're more sterling. No, some of it you're like, it's got a beard. But sometimes it looks like a mark and it's just a wrinkle. Yeah, I know. Yeah, See, it's, it's plastic. I don't see a thing in Imitation jewelry made in Hong Kong. <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, these are beautiful. Champagne coupes or dessert sherbet. Oh, the Beatrix Potter. So cute. Oh, they see now. That's the case I need. Mm hmm. Isn't it? Mm hmm. Yes, isn't this the greatest little case? Yes, this is the greatest little case. There's the strawberry again. <laughs> Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, what are they all for? Okay. Oh, that one's pretty right mm -hmm. there. Oh, boy. Oh, that butterfly. Wow. I know. remember about antique stores in general is that though some things are vintage and antique some things are actually repops and what I mean by that is reproductions this store looked like it was right out of the black lights of the 60s and 70s shops uh, smoke shops etc but everything was probably 80s and a little retro vibe going on there so just uh, be aware of that but it was so much fun Oh, wow, look at that. We learned something today. I did. <laughs> this is called the wedding box because it was made for a bride to put and preserve her wedding cake piece, a, p a slice of her wedding cake in here. Look at that. Yeah, that's what it says right here. It, candy dish. So you put it there. Yeah, these. See, that's what they're made for. Look at the white one. It's gorgeous. All of these are called wedding box. Now we know. Now I'm going to sound smarter on my video. Okay. You know, I have to sound smart. <laughs> I got to give a lesson. Okay, right. We have to have a lesson. Yeah, definitely that. Oh, 
these are beautiful. Here are the cats. Oh, they're darling. <laughs> Their shelf sitters are the best. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cute. They are darling. Mm -hmm. And this Siamese, oh, so regal. They're a little plastic or glass. No, they're very thin glass. Bud vases, so cute. Going to these amazing stores honestly feels like going to an amusement park where you need more than one day to take it all in because there was literally jewelry in every single corner. If I didn't look this way or that way, I was going to miss it. But I didn't miss this fantastic confetti lucite curb necklace. I love it. And actually, Becky had seen it as well. And um, she says she had showed it to me, but I think I was busy looking at something else. <laughs> And then I saw it. Great, great day of antiquing. precious this little storefront is. They said it was a J.C. Penney, a furniture store before the J.C. Penney, when you really did some window shopping. <gasps> Look at the Longhorns! Oh, they're darling. All right, let's go on to the next one. These right here, Becky, they're so funny. I had one just like it. You know what these came with? But my father bought this for my mother. It was door-to-door -door sales, oh. and it was full of chocolate. It had layers of chocolate. Really? They had chocolate yes. in it? Yes, yes. That's, that's what it was sold. Oh, my goodness. It's so incredible. They used to sell everything door-to-door. -door. Yeah. Yeah, like C's chocolate or something like that was in it. Oh, I love C's. Yeah. Yeah, every time, if any of us go out there, we always bring it back. They have it in Houston. Do they? Mm-hmm. 
the song with the fruit. Oh, yeah, oh my that. gosh. Uh, Carmen Miranda style. And look at these glass. Uh, Unikite and Rotocrosite. The Jim Short Rooster, that's a cute one. We stepped into yet another shop, and this one was absolutely amazing. I have never seen so much Fiesta wear. They must have had every single color ever made. They had colors I had never seen. They had everything from the true vintage to the reissues of today. I have collected Fiesta wear for a long time. I stopped collecting it, I started collecting it, I shared it with my daughters, and now I'm starting again. <laughs> I love, love, love Fiesta Wars so much. God, I think I'm gonna get this loose site. It is. I've, I know, I, I I've never that. seen one in such good condition, even on the thinking, inside. Ah, oh, it's mm -hmm. gorgeous. Oh, it's cute. I know. I saw it. Well, another wonderful day was had with my beautiful friend Becky. We met right here on YouTube, and we are antiquing partners. And boy, did we have a great chicken fried steak. Well, I had the chicken fried steak. And yes, I had the lemon pie as well. It was amazing.